please ask us some some questions as to uh, try to get to know us a little bit better. Can okay, uh, shoot your uh, your first question. Okay, how was your first date with the girl? Well, obviously, um, I've been on many dates. Um, uh, usually, one of the cool spots that I like to bring a girl is um, Hot Topic in the mall or any uh, different uh, store like that. Sometimes even we'll go to Azumi's and we'll just walk around the mall together. And uh, so, you need a tissue. No, it's okay. So my first date was this. Um, this girl walks in. We uh, went to the um, the Strathmore movie theater, but she uh, didn't want to be in the same car as me, so she went with her friends in her car. So I, she was like two rows away from me. So I was, uh, or my car was, uh, a few cars away from hers. It was, um, it was a good day, I think. At home, what would be your favorite dish to make? Uh, I'm not very good in the kitchen, but I like uh, toast, Amer American toast. Toast it. That's right. My favorite go to dish to make at home is just an empty bowl of nothing miss. Despair. How are MMs made? Oof. Okay, so... <laughs> what would be the name of your debut album? If you had one. Darkness. Mine would probably be... Um... Would you like Fire to Set? Because... Uh, I worked at McDonald's for... Uh, when I was in 6th grade. Four, 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 and the my job was we like fries with that. So that's that's the words I like. Really? Okay. That's the words I like. Okay, if you could be a superhero, what would your power be? If I could be like a superhero, it would probably be something with like something where darkness would overtake the world and there would be no. But that's just what I think. Okay, I'll probably take a more positive note on that. I probably would do, um, I'll probably have a, a sort of a, a jet ski or like a skateboard with a jet ski engine on it that uh, I would ride in a lake or sometimes in a pond. Sometimes. Okay, have you ever done anything that your parents were disappointed in? My parents, my whole life is a disappointment to them. I haven't been able to do anything right, according to them. <laughs> Fuck you, Mom. I don't care. I'm gonna do whatever I want. Well, quite frankly, uh, uh, I remember one of the specific, one specific time was um, when uh, me and uh, this one kid that was in one of my classes I knew of, he's an associate of mine, was at band camp. And um, we, uh, one of the boys, we usually just mess around with each other, but he uh, put um, Nair in my uh, body lotion, and uh, I was uh, bald from head to toe. Um, but it was just like a um, prank, just friends doing that stuff. You know, like, um, it's my friends were. Another What's your best personality trait that you think that you have? Well, people tell me a lot of the time that um, I'm like a light in their life and that like I have like a very bold and beautiful personality and I would have to agree with them. And just uh, they say how, you know, just like such a positive outlook on life that I have. Uh, mine would probably be that uh, I'm extremely outgoing. I worked at customer service for four at uh, McDonald's, where there I um, my job was 
to ask, uh, would you like five to that? If you had one song to describe the person that you are, what would that song be? So I got a lot of listening to music, my mom said. <laughs> what would your perfect murder weapon be and why? I would say um, my perfect mur murder weapon would be um, my personality. It's just dark and cold and usually just drives people. You see, I'm a pacifist, so I would most likely not have one of a murder weapon. But uh, my uh, one of my friends has a motorcycle. My one of probably the coolest guy that I know. My neighbor is a motorcycle. If you had 24 hours left to live, what would you do in those 24 hours? Uh, watch well, this morning. Uh, I would really like to become a professional whistler. I'm pretty great at it now, but you know, I would like to make my living at it. I would do if I had 24 hours left. I would go into my mother's dark basement in her house. And I would just binge eat Giovanni films until I die. Okay, how did you lose your virginity? Huh. You yeah. uh so it was uh I know I know what that is, so yeah. It it happened I think. My first time was with um, Bernice and she broke my fucking heart. So Glenn, have you ever had your first kiss? Ah, uh, sure, of course I I think I have my, uh, um, nine of 12 uh, first kisses, I think, or zero. I don't know. Zero? Oh, think I better let it go. What you think about it, girl? You know I keep with this crumb shit, nigga. Yeah. We stay throwing it up. I am a bitch, baby, throwing it up.